Hi everyone, my name is Jo, I'm a percussionist. Welcome to Sessions from the Shore, presented by Furthest from the Sea. I'm running three sessions all about rhythm, called Inside Out, A Rhythmic Journey. So in these three videos, we're going to be listening to sounds, we're going to be creating some sounds, creating some rhythms, some beats, but we're not going to be using any instruments. In the first one, we're going to be using our bodies. The second one will be inspired by things that you might have in your home. And the third one is all about going outside and seeing what we can hear and create out there. It's probably an idea to watch these in order, me, inside and outside, because we will build on things that we've been doing in the previous videos. Okay, what kind of sounds can we make with our bodies? Shall we go for the obvious one first and stamp our feet? We could tap our legs. How about tapping your knees? Because actually that makes a slightly different sound, doesn't it? How about our chest? That's quite a low and soft sound, but be gentle. We could clap our hands together. And in fact, if we clap in different ways, we get different sounds. So if you put your hands together like this, it's a different sound from that. Or maybe you could just use the tips of your fingers. Really soft sound. So experiment with different claps. How about this one? Or around in a circle maybe. What about finger clicking? This is slightly trickier, so don't worry if you're not quite getting it at the moment. So what I'm doing in this video is I'm giving suggestions, all right, suggestions of sounds, suggestions of rhythms. You can create your own, okay, you don't have to do exactly what I'm doing. Have a go at making your own sounds and your own rhythms. We could use our voices, couldn't we? We could use words or we could go Or we could hum. Mm. Or a really good one for rhythms is this. Have a go at that. Do you know what? Even if I scratch my head, I get some good rhythms going there too. So have a little experiment and see what you can come up with. Okay, let's do a little warm up to get us going. Imagine just walking nice and slowly so we've got a regular beat with our feet or a regular pulse with our feet and we could clap at the same time one two three four one two three four if there are two of you doing this together maybe one of you would like to stamp and the other could clap. So the feet are just gonna keep going on that beat, but the clapping is gonna change. So keep those feet going. How about this? Stamp, clap, 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 stamp, clap. Did you get on with that one? Should we try a different one? Here we go. And we still got that pulse going. What should we do next? How about this one? Okay, let's try another one. This one goes slightly off the beat. Here we go.
Okay, let's get a little drum beat going. Let's start off with this. Boom, boom, ba. Boom, boom, ba. Boom, boom, ba. Boom, boom, ba. How are you doing out there? Boom, boom, ba. Boom, boom, ba. Boom, boom, ba. Boom, boom, ba. Okay, we're gonna fill in the gaps now. So let's start off by going gum gum ga go gum go gum. Okay, gum gum ga go gum go gum. And then we have a little gap at the end again, just for a minute. Gum gum ga go gum go gum. Gum gum ga go gum go gum. Gum gum ga go gum go gum. Gum gum ga go gum go gum 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 ga go gum go gum. How are you doing with that? Is it time to fill in the gap? So we could do a just final clap in that last little gap there. So we've got this. Gum gum ga go gum go gum ga 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 gum gum ga go gum Okay, are you ready to make up some of your own beats now? What we're going to do is to use the beat that we've just done, but then there's going to be a little gap for you to create your own rhythm, okay? So remember our rhythm was... And it fits into a count of four, like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And remember, if you just want to go... And then do the waiting. You can do that instead. Okay, so we're going to play our rhythm three times, and instead of the fourth time, there's those four beats for you to do whatever you want. So have a listen. We've got this one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then there's a gap. Two, three, Four, and then we're back etc so that gap is for you to do whatever you want so maybe you want to stamp your feet play on your knees chest clicking maybe you want to speak in the gap or make some vocal sounds so whatever you want as long as it lasts for four beats and we come back into the rhythm here we go a one two three four Here it comes. And back again. Here it comes. And back again. Here it comes. And back again. Last one. Okay, try this one. Gum, go, go, back. Gum, go, go, back. Gum, go, go, back. Gum, go, go, back. How about using your chest instead? Gum, go, go, ba. Gum, go, go, ba. Or maybe some clicks. Gum, go, go, ba. Gum, go, go, ba. Maybe you'd like to stamp your feet. 
So see if you can find your own way of making that beat. Maybe you just want to use your voice. Gung, go, gung, ba. Gung, go, gung, ba. Or find some different sounds. Okay, so we're using that rhythm, but you don't have to do it the same way that I'm doing it. Now you'll notice that there's a little gap at the end of it, isn't there again? So gung, go, gung, ga. Gung, go, gung, ga. So there's two beats this time, two beats to fill. Now there are different ways that you could do this. You could try doing the whole thing, so you could go gung, go gung, get, and then fill those two beats however you want. Remember, you can use the, all the different sounds as long as it just fills those two beats, so you can come back to the rhythm again. If there's more than one of you doing this together, maybe you could do it like a call and response. So one of you goes gung. Go gung ga, and then the other fills the gap. Gung go gung ga, ch 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 ch. Gung go gung ga, go gung go gung go. Okay, so you could do it like a call and response with two people. If it's just you watching the video, maybe you could do it as a call and response with me. So you listen to me go gung go gung ga, and then you fill in the gap. So however you want to do it. Okay, let's give it a go. After a count of four, here we go. A one, two. Three, four, gong, go gong, ga, gong, go gong, ga, oh yeah, gong, go gong, ga, gong, go gong, ga, ha, gong, go gong, ga, sh, 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 gong, go gong, ga, oh yeah, gong, go gong, ga, gong, go gong, ga, hey, gong, go gong, ga. Gong, go, gong, ga, oh yeah. Gong, go, gong, ga, gong, go, gong, ga, boom, boom. Gong, go, gong, ga, gong, go, gong, ga, oh yeah. Gong, go, gong, ga, gong, go, gong, ga, hut. So we've been counting in fours quite a lot, haven't we? So why don't we count in threes this time? Here we go, let's try this. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Chest, clap, clap, chest, clap, clap, chest, clap, clap, chest, clap, clap. How about swaying at the same time? Chest, clap, clap, 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 chest, clap, clap. If you want a harder one, maybe you could put a click in there. Maybe you could go. Chest click clap, chest click clap, chest click clap. Try that one if you want to. Okay, I'm just going to go with the chest clap clap for now. But if you want to try and find different ways, that would be brilliant. Okay, we're going to put that gap in again, but we're going to do something different with it. So we're going to do our count of three, three times, and we're going to miss the fourth one. So it'll go like this. A one, two, three, a one, two, three, a one, two, three. A one, two, three, a one, two, three, a one, two, three. Can you strike a pose? A one, two, three, a one, two, three, one, two, three. A one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, also in that gap, whilst you're striking that pose, can you shout your name? So my name is Jo, so I would go something like this. A one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, Jo! A one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, Jo! A one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, Joe! A one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, Joe! Now my name has only got one sound to it, hasn't it? Joe, just one sound. But if your name was Billy, Billy, that's two sounds. So you could say Billy, do it nice and slowly, or you could go fast, Billy. If your name was Adrian, 
How many sounds is that? Adrian. It's three, isn't it? So again, you could do it slowly, Adrian, or you could go Adrian. Okay. If your name was Felicity, Felicity, that's four sounds. Felicity, Felicity. Okay. So you need to decide how to say your name. If your name has only got one sound like mine, there's not a lot you can do with it. But if you've got more than one sound in your name, you decide how you're going to say your name. Okay, and then see if you can put it in there when we strike that pose. Here we go, after three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Joe. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Joe. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Joe. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Joe. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Joe. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Joe. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Joe. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Joe. Okay, here's a little challenge for anyone who wants it. We're going to count in five. A one, two, three, four, five. A one, two, three, four, five. Okay? One foot is going to stamp on one, and the other foot is going to stamp on four. So I've got this. A one, two, three, four, five. 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 It's a bit like a wonky walk, isn't it? A one, two, three, four, five. 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 Okay, let's put a clap on beat number two. So we've got a one, two, three, four, five. A one, two, three, four, five. A one, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. One, 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 two, three, four, five. How are you doing with that? Is that a bit of a strange one? Okay, let's take the clap out just for a minute. And we're going to play twice on your knees on five. So one directly on five and one just after. A bit like this. A one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Shall we put it all together? So we've got a stamp on one, clap on two, nothing on three, stamp on four, knees on five. Let's give it a go. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. 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 Well done, well done having a go at that one. You could try that around the house, couldn't you? You could walk around the house doing that one. Let's do a little beat in 6-8 time. If you don't know what 6-8 time is, it doesn't matter. If you play folk music at all, it's jig time. If you know nursery rhymes, a lot of nursery rhymes are actually in 6-8, so Jack and Jill went up the hill, da 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 that kind of feel. So let's just try it on our chest. So we're gonna go. Can we try it on our knees? Okay, can we try doing it once on our chest and then once on our knees? So alternate between your chest and your knees. So we're gonna go. Let's 
have a little gap there. So chest, knees, chest. Chest, knees, chest. Shh. 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 One more thing. If you like clicking, you could go chest, chest, click, knees, knees, click, chest, chest, click. Okay, so the final one each time is a click, if you want to. So if you don't want to, that's fine. Just stick with what we've got. So chest, 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 knees, 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 chest, 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 shh. Okay, so if you want to do the more uh, complicated version, it's chest, chest, click, knees, knees, click, chest, chest, click. Okay, so I'll do that version for now. All right, so after four, uh, one, two, three, four. Okay, we're going to finish this video with a vegetable wrap. So we're going to have a drum type part underneath using our bodies and then we're going to have a vocal part over the top, a bit of an improvisatory vocal part over the top. So our drum parts, we've got the feet going on the pulse again. And if that's all you want to do, that's absolutely fine because that'll hopefully keep everyone else in time. So this is another one that if you've got lots of people playing these rhythms together, you can all take different parts if you want to. So that's the most basic part to keep everyone together, just that pulse. Okay, the next part is gonna go chest, click, clap, clap. 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 Chest, Chest, click, clap, clap, chest, click, clap, clap. If you're not sure about the clicking, you could go chest, chest, clap, clap, chest, chest, clap, clap, chest, chest, clap, clap. So you choose which one you want to go for. So if we put both those parts together, the feet and the hands, we've got this kind of thing. So this is our underlying rhythm. Or without the clicks. to get some inspiration for our vegetable wrap. So let's get that beat going again. Okay, do you think you could make some rhythms with vegetable names that will fit with this beat? Shall we have a go? Broccoli. Cabbage. Broccoli. Cabbage. What else have we got there? Potato, 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 leek. Do you want to have a go? Courgette, carrot. Courgette, carrot. Cauliflower. See if you can try. Pepper, pepper. Asparagus, pepper, pepper. Asparagus, potato, potato. 
onion leek, broccoli. Have another go. Carrot, 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 broccoli, carrot. Cauliflower, carrot, onion, leek, potato. Sweet potato. Asparagus, asparagus. Aubergine, courgette. Potato, 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 carrot, potato, potato, cauliflower, cabbage, cauliflower, cabbage, broccoli. Should we try a little bit faster? You can just stick with one vegetable name if you want to, or maybe two. Potato, carrot. Potato, carrot, potato, carrot, broccoli, potato, carrot, broccoli. How are you getting on? Cauliflower leek, cauliflower leek. Pepper, 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 carrot. Pepper, 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 carrot. Potato, 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 carrot. Potato, potato, potato. Cauliflower! Brilliant, well done. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope your hands and legs are okay after all that. My next session will be all about using objects from around the home to create music, create rhythms. So have a look around, see what you've got that you might be able to use. There are various other sessions going on as part of Sessions from the Shore. So there's tap dancing with Becky, art with Abby and writing with Carnage. So look out for those on the Furthest from the Sea Facebook page and do send us your videos and photos and comments as well. We'd really love to see how you're getting on. Thank you very much. Bye.